surprised that they were coming loose. I need to bring this one on the feet anyway. Okay, so I'm back. It's been a couple of weeks since my last video now. Having a bit of a vacation from YouTube. Uh, we have been trenching a lot. And now, as the crops are growing, so are the weeds. That means we have to handle those too. Uh, especially on the Swedes, we don't have any good chemicals. So, But that has been... Uh, yeah, has been making a weed handler, handler killer, something, something mechanical. Here you can see the carrot fields back in my place, and in the background, just under the sun, you can see my brother is trenching with our chain digger. So we have been working on this for a couple of weeks now, and. Uh, it's still plenty of work because we need to take every fourth meter. But uh, that's a different story. I will show you this a little bit later. But now, Cosmin will come behind me with the Kubota and that newly built, newly built frame uh, with the weed killer stuff. There are some discs, there are some plows. It's not quite ready yet. And we have never ever tested it because it's it was finished uh, last weekend. So now we need to bring it on the field. We need to adjust the discs, the wheels, the, the plows, so we can fit um, the rows. And hopefully we'll get it done. And hopefully it will work as we hope it will. It doesn't necessarily need to kill all the weeds, but it needs to disturb them as much as uh, the Swedes need and uh, as much as uh, we hope it can do so we'll jump over to the sweet farm and uh, i will spend some time tweaking and working on this in this frame so here you can see 
the weeds are coming. It's mostly grass on this field, but um, I can see some other plants there too. So this shows you what I'm talking about. We need to fight these weeds. We'll check out the field closer when Cosmin arrives because it's a little bit windy. And I can show you some sweet plants. So the plan is to get this running and then I will go and pick up a new implement. I will keep this as a secret until the end of the video. I'm not feeling very well today, so I don't know how much of a video I will make, but I will at least get Cosmin going and pick up this tool and maybe I will call it a day then. I just put some gas. Four. Okay, so now that this one is running, and you can see the result it's making, I'm a little bit worried that uh, we'll get too much non-compacted soil because it, when it rains into this stuff it's gonna create a terrible mess but uh, we need to try it out so I promise you to show you some sweet plants so we'll see if we can find some between this they are very much like this weeds but this one is a sweet plant they are planted at, uh, or seeded at, I think it's every 15 centimeters. So 
So the plan is, or yeah, the plan is to yeah, actually bought a brush, mechanical brush uh, weather that's gonna serve on the top of the drill to manage these weeds but it's currently stuck in Denmark and uh, was supposed to come last week but uh, Covid and the war in Ukraine and uh, how the world is going on is it's um, yeah it's creating some mess for us so it's stuck still in Denmark it was supposed to come last week and but uh, yeah this is how the world is how these days so he will work on this field this field that field and that field on top there and there are two fields back at the main farm i'm guessing uh, it will take yes roughly two days to finish up this. Okay, so I will go and pick up our new equipment and uh, bring it back home and I think I will call it a day, I call it a day after that. Yep, that's right. It's a brand new Machio Power, power Harrow. Uh, it's not an upgrade, it's to have uh, along with the other one that we have just in case that one breaks down we have had some issues with it in the past where it's breaking down just before seeding so now we have another one and it will be primarily used to cover drain tiles when we're trenching but it's also strong enough that we can put our, the drill uh, and uh, we can also put uh, the lifting for the cedar so it's the pro version it's the best version I think that they produce it's the same width as the other one three meters and it doesn't come with a quick uh, hitch and we don't need that either because it's fairly heavy and it's better to hook it straight up to the arms of the tractor Okay, so I will take this home and we'll take a better look at it. <clears throat> so, it's looking nice. It's not brand brand new it's been sitting outside a little bit I think it was a demo which we bought for a cheaper price than what a new one would cost and this will have for yeah the other one is 20 years so hopefully we'll have this for a long time it's not much to say about it it's a gearbox a PTO shaft lots few adjustments you can do the knives look good and the on our soil tab, we barely have to change any knives at all, so it's nice to have this one. Okay, so that's it. It's a little bit reduced this video. I will become, I will come back stronger in the future, but uh, until now, I need to go in inside and sleep. So thanks for watching, guys. Remember to check out all of my other videos. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and remember to check out my Instagram.